Okay. Hi, this is JT Wisdom. Uh, and uh, on this Memorial Day, I just I wanted to come on. My hubby and I are honoring all those who uh, who lost their lives uh, in order for us to have freedom. In order for us to be able to do do you know to live in our homes, to be able to do what we do and in our everyday lives because if it wasn't if it wasn't for them fighting for our country we would not be able to to do what we do so honoring those who who've lost their lives and you know, those soldiers who've lost their lives in, in in war in battle and also honoring uh, those who are serving and fighting for our country now And uh, I just wanted to say that because, um, I mean, if it, if it wasn't for those who, for the soldiers who fought for our country, we would, we would not be able to, to be free. So just as my shirt says, freedom, 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 it's freedom. So, uh, so honoring and remembering on this Memorial Day. So when you're you know, barbecuing, you know, you're putting that steak on the on the barbecue grill. Make sure you all take some time out of your day to remember those soldiers who fought for for our country, um, for 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 our country. You know, let let them let America let America all of America just stop and remember the soldiers who fought for our country. And again, honoring those who are serving and fighting for our country today. I'm Lieutenant General Gary Valeski, the commander of America's First Corps. I'm Command Sergeant Major Walter Tagalkid, Command Sergeant Major, America's First Corps. Today we remember and honor the men and women who made the ultimate sacrifice in defense of our great nation. While some see Memorial Day as the beginning of summer, we hold it as a sacred day to reflect and remember our fallen comrades. It is our sacred duty to ensure that the names of our fallen and their memory are not lost to history. And Memorial Day events held here on JBLM in the Pacific Northwest and across America ensures we always remember them. We want to express our deepest gratitude to our Gold Star families. You bear the greatest burden of your loved one's sacrifice and we can never thank you enough in a way that will make up for your loss. Today at three o'clock, we ask that each of you observe the National Moment of Remembrance to reflect the great sacrifices our fallen have given to our great nation. Courage! So have a, have a safe Memorial Day. This is JT Wisdom and Jesus loves you.